the first thing you got to do when you get to the cabin is get you a good fire started. No cabin is a cabin without a fire going. Next thing you gotta do is check the fridge for beer. If there's any less than this amount, go to the store and get some more for Johnny. Then just clean the place up a little bit. It's the least you could do. Next, you gotta turn the water on. The valves for turning the water on are underneath Johnny's pristine landscaping that surrounds the Ohio cabin. All you got to do is close the bleeder valve on the right and open the water valve on the left. The outside spigot will turn on when the valve is open. So you got to use Johnny's custom made tool to close the outside spigot. The spigot and the inside spouts are left on to keep the place from freezing up. Go ahead and close all the valves in the house so that the water lines can fill up. Let the water run on hot in the shower until it starts to flow nicely. That means the water heater is all filled up. Then flip the breaker for the water heater and you got yourself a nice warm shower. After you got the water all taken care of, this is a good time to get a pot of coffee started. Good rule of thumb when coming to the cabin is to bring your own coffee. That way you know you have some. Coffee is also a real important part of this place being a good cabin. The decoration in the cabin is just as it should be. A bunch of deer heads and sheds laying everywhere and some old deer hunting pictures. There's no cell service. There's no internet. Entertainment is limited, which is how it's supposed to be at a cabin. There is a DVD player, so bring your favorite movie. This was a pretty good movie, and this one really wasn't that good. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven places for a grown man to sleep. This back room is the king suite. And in the king suite, if you need some dough and estrus, it's laying between the angle grinder and the snacks. If you're planning on cooking, you're going to have to hook up the propane. The propane tanks are in Johnny's scent-free hunting room. To hook up the propane, you got to take apart Johnny's waterproofing system for the propane line. Then it's just plug and play. If you don't know how to run a propane tank, you probably don't need to be at the cabin. Next, just go ahead and get any chores that need to be done finished. The gutters needed to be cleaned out, so I just went ahead and cleaned the gutters right quick. Another good rule of thumb is to bring firewood to the cabin. Bring more than you think you're going to use. There's can always be left over, and it's an easy way to give back to Johnny for letting you stay at his cabin. About this time, your coffee should be good and warm, so pour you a cup of coffee. Then it's time for the best part about being in a cabin, relaxing by the wood stove. 